All right, so I finally ended up getting Lilia to level 90, Super Awakened 6, and all that stuff. So, um, I really wish I had dupes for Lilia. Um, she's only at 58k for me right now. I could get this up if I had got her Holy Relic. A Holy Relic gives you, what, 2,000, somewhere around there, CC. So, she would be literally, like, 60k exactly, some, something like that. Um, but also, her rolls are not, not the greatest, um... I did at least try and put them all above 14, but then I, I ended up like getting really low on Anvil, so I couldn't really do it, but it's okay. I'm pretty sure that she's still going to perform really good because she's an absolute beast of a unit. But before we get into the showcase, if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Trying to reach 7,000 sub, uh, subscribers by the end of the year, so if you could help me out, I would greatly appreciate it. But yeah, Lilia is an absolute monster with Keo. Now again, I don't have her holy relic so this video is going to be just without the holy relic but we're going to see how strong she can be i'm pretty sure that she's going to perform well i don't think that she's going to perform like the greatest but you know she should do really good regardless of the fact that she doesn't have her holy relic um i, I wanted to make this video because i i said that without her holy relic she's not the greatest but with Kyo next to her and her still being, you know, pretty decent, I think that she's still going to be really good um, without it, right? So with Kyo, she's she's good without Kyo and without the Holy Relic, as she's not doing much of anything. So um, you're going to see a really big, like, damage um, difference. I, I promise you, you will. But that's why we have King. So King's here for that exact reason. Um... Margaret can just cleanse, so I guess we could just waste this card because I'm pretty sure that uh, this person is running the evade food. So we're gonna do this, and then I'm gonna try and kill the Margaret. Let's see how much damage that we can do with Lilia. So, um, evasion food, no, e okay, no evasion food. All right, so you can see the damage that she's doing without the holy relic, and it, it, it's actually fairly strong. Um, but yeah, see, right there, if we would have had the holy relic, she would have killed, she honestly would have killed without like without fail look how many kill cards that we got <laughs> look how many kill cards that we drew that's crazy but um yeah with with the holy relic she would have been gone like she actually would have been dead um but kill kill here again Kyo here is making a really big difference in the damage that we're doing because Kyo is going to make it that king's doing more damage lily is doing more damage like it's, it's actually insane but um yeah, Lilia's a little squishy, too. I, I her defense related stats aren't that good, but, it, you know, it is what it is. All right, let's do this. Um, I'm actually debating on killing Gother. Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. All right, King should do some... Okay, he, he did a little bit of damage. Not, not, the, not the craziest amount, but he did some damage. Uh, can we kill Gother? Ah, uh, we just, just about did. I mean, look at this team, though. Look look at his team. His team is almost dead, all of them, even Escanor. And we didn't even, like, full focus on Escanor, which is the craziest part about it. And Escanor is literally halfway. Um, I, I'm thinking now he's going to go all out on uh, Kyo, right? He's going to try and kill Kyo. No, he's going after King. Okay. I mean, that, that, you know, that is that is smart going after King. But the thing is, he's not going to crit King. <laughs> he's like, oh, well, actually, never mind. He, he did crit K. Okay. Um, all right. Sure. Whatever. Now, I want to see if Lilia. This might be th this might be risking it, but I want to see if Lilia m could kill possibly Escanor. Maybe. Mm, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. All right. How much damage are we going to do here? All right. That's pretty good damage. Oh, Margaret would have been dead if we would have had an AoE. All right. See, this is what I mean, man. The Holy Relic is so good. Like, her Holy Relic, if we would have had it, it's just so good for Lydia. It, it actually is really, really good for Lydia. But um, I know many people probably won't be able to get the Holy Relic because, you know, maybe you haven't grinded the big bird. Uh, You know, maybe you just don't want to do the damn bird. I wouldn't blame you because that, that, <laughs> that bird is... <laughs> yeah, but... You know, maybe, you know, people don't have the Holy Relic, so it's not like they can run it. So this is a good showcase of what she can do legit just with Kyo, right? Just HP defense gear, um, just Kyo as a as a partner. Like, Kyo is her best friend. Kyo is actually her best friend. Um, King King as well is helping a lot. So, yeah, that, that is good that King is here because King, it just makes it possible. We could just do this, maybe. 
Um, hmm. All right, how about I do this? Boom. Boom. And this should kill, this should kill Margaret, right? I think. Please kill Margaret, please kill Margaret. Oh my God, I got really scared right there, but okay, we managed. <laughs> we actually managed to kill Margaret before Escanor. All right, that made a big difference, by the way. Like, that made a huge, huge difference. If we had not killed his Escanor, oh my God, that, this match would have been went real sideways real quick. But yeah, um, so that was that was the first match. Again, she did good. She she actually did really really good. And keep in mind, her ult is useful too because she removes buffs. So if the enemy has any type of buffs, like if this Elizabeth actually had her revive or something like that or not her revive her um her alt we could just take it off with Lilia. like that that is a really strong alt but yeah um the, the, he he can't really do anything uh just just you know just to make sure that he dies i'm probably just gonna do this yeah yeah this should this should do it right yeah he's done all right let me go ahead and i'm gonna, I'm gonna just cut all right so here we are in the second match and we're actually facing off against pretty unique kind of setup i guess um i don't really see this around a lot so yeah it's pretty pretty unique i guess um all right let's go ahead i i mean really we could just do this his pierce card is gonna destroy the barrier that we put up with king but i mean it's all good right as long as we prevent him from getting the ult yeah i think actually taking melee out might be best case scenario i don't really think that this team is going to give me too much too much of an issue if anything the bear from elizabeth might be the most annoying do we proc revive here wow wow we actually proc the revive right there i mean that's both good and bad because now he doesn't have ignites on him but i mean you you saw right there the damage that lilia just did like i mean when i say she's crazy she is crazy once we get a counter to kill though who remove like if we get a unit that removes debuffs at the start of every turn or something like that on all uh, um allies i'm telling you right now like <laughs> he he's gonna get cucked and so is lilia to an extent so um keep that in mind too it, it's just lilia's really really strong with um keo right if you don't have keo don't even know if there's another unit you could actually run like i'm 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 serious. I don't know if there's another unit you could run with um with this Lilia to make her even like remotely good, right? Um, maybe I, I, I yeah again I, I don't know because again Keo is giving her so many ignites that she's going crazy without the holy relic. Keep that again. I'm gonna keep saying this without the holy relic, right? Keo is helping her damage with the ignites and she also has flood on her um her skill and then her passive is the same as bonds like she's she's just doing a lot right she's just she's actually doing a lot with her kit I, i'm a fan i am actually a fan this is why i put lilia in tier one when i made a tier list video this is exactly why lilia was in tier one and i think i'm i might i might put her in tier like at the top of tier one i don't know if i'm gonna put her in tier z uh zero because that's like that's reserved for the you know the really really big occasions right or the people who can just ba basically just make pvp just a joke wow we just completely decimated his his entire squad how much damage will this do okay 101k again she doesn't have her holy relic <laughs> just remember that this is this is lilia without her damn holy relic and she's just popping off like this she's a, she's such a beast man she's actually a beast of a unit all right classic glue eater okay all right i've been seeing a lot of classic glue eater a lot um lately so it's pretty interesting all right let's do this Escanor is the one with the ign oh wait wait wait, wait. i almost messed that up I almost messed that up all right we'll do this boom and then we'll do boom again king here helping her you know her damage i really wanted uh, you know a part of me made a dumb mistake probably getting merlin's holy relic before lilia's i'm gonna I'm a just be honest with you i think i made a um a dumb dumb like i think i made a, a stupid because i should have probably just got oh okay okay king look at look at we got no lily <laughs> i guess it doesn't matter he just he just quit he just literally said nah i'm good <laughs> he said i'm good all right so we're into the what is it the fourth match and yo this video is actually i think this is a bot but this video is actually taking forever uh yeah it is a bot but i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna play it out anyway 
because I really, I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't want to search for, for real people, it's, it's really, like, it's going on midnight for me, so, um, yeah, I really don't want to search for people, but, again, I really can't wait to get her holy relic, when she, like, with her holy relic, I don't know what they were thinking with this unit, like, I, I actually don't know what they were thinking, because she just does so, and we got a, oh my god, she just does so much, like, her and Summer Merlin, Yo, her and Summer and Merlin are just different. Like, I know they're, they are seasonal units, right? So it's like, they had to make them somewhat good, but damn, they didn't have to go off. You know what I mean? Like, ooh, okay, cool. So I actually did some damage to my Kia. Wait, calm down, calm, calm down. Chill, chill, all right? All right, we gotta take out Kyo. That That's it, that's, he has to, Kyo dies tonight. Um, yeah, yeah, that, that should be good, that should be good, but, um, yeah, like, they just made them, like, stupid, I don't know, they, they just actually made them dumb, but the way, like, the damage that they, they do is just insane, and, you know what's crazy, Lilia's doing all of this without critting, yeah, that, that's another thing y'all gotta remember, like, she's doing all of this, you know, this damage, you know, you know she's, she even has Dissolve, and she's not, she don't give two, two craps about critting at all like genuinely like she doesn't care <laughs> it's insane like the damage that she does um all right can we kill zell like can we actually just kill zelders in one go come on Lilia. let me let me see that damage and let me see that damage Lilia. oh <laughs> you see what i mean man with the holy relic we would have been eating we actually would have ate like, mm, mm, like we would have been eating right you know? <laughs> but all right let me let me go ahead and let me cut this was a, i just wanted to uh to play this match out because one i didn't want to you know search for a real person and two i just I, I just wanted to play it out all right Ooh, okay he was okay he was right there in terms of cc all right all right so we're facing off against this person with uh you know classic trader melee go there in uh the one i feel like this might actually become the normal like this team right here might actually become the normal um okay yeah you know what i might actually just can i one i don't think i can okay all right, I was gonna say, can I just one pop uh, Gother? But you know, it, it's it is what it is. Let me go ahead and let me do. I think I'm gonna do one more, one more matchup. I, I think Lilia, right? You guys know how good Lilia is. If you have Christmas Lilia, please work on her. Please work on her. Um, she is one of the units in PvP that is actually just a dominant force. If you don't have, okay, if you don't have Kyo, maybe, maybe you don't have to work on her, right? <laughs> because again, I genuinely don't think that with anyone else she's gonna do what she does now right it, it just it is what it is right there's nothing you can actually do about that it's just how she was built because she does i mean i don't have her holy relic though so yeah yeah you know most of this is coming from kill like all right he has evasion food like he has to he definitely has evasion food um should i waste a lilia card i feel like i should just waste kill yeah, I feel like I should just waste a Kyo card. Um, yeah, see, yeah, let's just do that. We get the increase with King. Now, now watch the damage that she does on King. Just, just watch. You see, and then, like, she's dumb. Like, she, she's crazy. Like, I mean, this is without her relic. You got it. Like, yo, if this is the power creep for units, I, I'm here for it. I'm, I'm actually here for this. Um, this like sort of power creep for units now. I, I don't know if this is, you know, if this is legit gonna be the norm, but my God, man, the units that they've been releasing recently, they've just been monsters. Like, you see what I mean? Like, look at King. King, King's going crazy. Uh, unfortunately though, her, her flood, if we had it, wouldn't do that much, right? But, um, oh, he healed up a lot too. Hmm. I mean, we. I mean, we've seen all we could from Lilia anyway without her holy relic. With, with, I mean, again, without her holy relic, she she's not looking the, the craziest, right? She's not she's not looking the craziest. But if I had a holy relic, you can trust and believe the damage that we would have. First off, we would have killed the king, right? Right here, we would have probably just ended up murking this entire team with her relic. Like without her relic, she's more fair. I think actually without her relic, you can make the argument that she is actually a little bit more fair. <laughs> than she is with the holy relic because at least you stand somewhat of a chance right 
Like this player is like, okay, I, I won. Like he 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 won. And there's no no doubt about that. He definitely won because Kyo's dead. And again, oh well, okay, Lilia and Kyo both died. Like without again, with without her holy relic, you know, you could end up getting like completely body slammed. But with the holy relic, yeah, okay. Like good good luck, right? Good luck. But again, I'm in the video. Let me know what you guys think of Lilia down in the comments below. I'm pretty sure a lot of you like this unit. And if you don't like this unit, well, I mean, you probably don't have Kiel, let's be real. So yeah, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you could, I would greatly appreciate it if you would drop a like, help support the channel. And uh, as always, you guys already know, I will see you all later.